Good morning, friends. I'm here at Walgreens again, getting ready to do a few deals. I'm gonna do the Gillette spend deal. You spend $20, get 10,000 points back, and I'll be using digitals and a register reward with that. Hopefully, that register reward doesn't kick out any of these digitals, but we'll just, I'll report back and let you know how it goes. Certain Royal B and Crest products are on promotion for $3 each this week. When you buy two, you get a $4 register reward. Some toothbrushes are included. I will, however, be picking up the toothpaste because we have a dollar paper coupon and a dollar digital coupon. After those coupons, you'll be paying $4 but getting back a $4 register reward. The Elvive is priced regularly at $4.99 each. We have a dollar off two IVC coupon and a $3 off two digital coupon. This isn't the best deal that we get on Elvive, but I want to add it to my spend deal, so I'm going to pick it up. The next deal that I'm going to do is the King C Gillette deal. It's on promotion when you spend 20, you get 10,000 bonus points. The shave gel is priced at $7.99 and the beard balm is priced at $12.99, making them $20.98 total. I also have a $2 off coupon on the shave gel and a $4 off coupon on the beard balm, making it $14.98 after those two coupons. However, I won't be paying that out of pocket because I'm combining this in a spent deal. The Colgate is on promotion for $2.99 each, and when you buy two, you'll get a $2 register reward back. We also have a $4 off coupon. After that coupon, you'll pay $1.98 and get back a $2 register reward. If you still have those Febreze buy one get one free coupons, they're great to add to a spend deal. They're two for six dollars, but after that coupon, it'll just be three dollars for both or a dollar fifty each. Just left the store and everything went as planned. Thankfully, uh, my register reward did not kick off any of my digitals. I feel like when I first started couponing, I would call customer service every single week, and. I haven't called customer service in over a month, so I'm really happy about that. So I'll get back to the house and show you everything at my dining room house, table. And this is everything that I picked up today. The first transaction that I did was the Crest because I wanted to get that $4 register reward to use on my next transaction. So as you can see, two for, they were two for $3. I had a dollar digital coupon and a dollar paper coupon. Um, they both came off, so my subtotal was $4. I used $4 in points and paid only tax, paid zero subtotal, and I got back that $4 register reward, making it basically free. As long as they offer free toothpaste, I'm going to pick it up because even if I can't use it, I can always donate it to someone in need or give it to a family member. So on the next deal, I got everything else. I got these two King C Gillette products, the Colgate, the Elvive, and the Febreze. Mainly I wanted these products because I think that they would make really good Christmas gifts. And guys, Christmas is not that far away. I really like the packaging on these, so I think they would make great stocking stuffers. Or if I can bundle a few things together and give them like in a little gift basket, I think it would make a really nice gift. So I'll show you my receipt. So as you can see, the Febreze, two for six, then the Colgate, the King C Gillette, the Elvive, and you can see the IVC coupon of a dollar off two coming off, the shave gel, and then all of my coupons. The Febreze coupon came off, the Colgate, the Beard Balm, the Elvive, the shave gel, and then my register reward is the last one. If you add up all of these coupons in the register reward, it equals $20. So I've already met the spend requirement of $20 for the King C Gillette deal to get the 10,000 points back. It does not matter that not all of these coupons were for Gillette. Um, the system at Walgreens counts these as forms of payment. So I've met the spend requirement just using these coupons in my register reward. So my subtotal was $21.94. I redeemed $20 in points, paying $1.94 subtotal, and then my tax. And I got back 11,890 bonus points, 210 everyday points. That is 12,100 points. 10,000 points was from the King C. Gillette deal. 1,890 points was from the 10 times the everyday points multiplier, and then 210 everyday points. I also got back a $2 register reward for the Colgate Palm Olive. So if I had just gone into the store and bought the King C. Gillette Shave Gel and the Beard Balm, 
This was $7.99, this was $12.99. That would have been $20.98. I could have used the $2 off coupon here and the $4 coupon off here, paying $14.98. I would have gotten 10,000 points back, but I would have had to have paid $14.98 out of pocket. Combine it with all these other products, I only paid $1.94 subtotal out of pocket, and I was able to get everything else in this transaction, except for the crest, that was my first transaction. So I am really happy that this spend deal worked out well. Um, I watched Jody Dunn's channel and she's the one who taught me how to use points on a spend deal and I'm really grateful for that. I'm probably gonna go back to Walgreens and take advantage of their beauty buy two get one free promotion that's running that's ending soon. If I do that, I'll probably just put it on my Instagram, which is the same as this channel name, Amy Way to Save, if you're interested in checking that out. This video, and if you're not subscribed already, please subscribe. I almost hit 100 subscribers, and I'm really excited about that. Let me know what you're picking up at Walgreens this week.